The third game we're going to play is called Shoots and Ladders. For this game, you are going to need to have your dog on a leash because it's not really possible to play off. So what I'm going to do is put him on a leash real quick. Alright. So what we're going to do is Shoots and Ladders is just like the kid game. If you've ever played Shoots and Ladders with, as a kid, you've got your spaces and as you move forward, if you hit a ladder, you go up and if you hit a slide, you go down. That is going to be the same concept for our dogs. I'm going to start off without a distraction. I'm sorry, it's over there, okay? Oh, hang on, that was bad. Um, I'm going to start off kind of without a distraction, and I'm going to start back here. I'm going to ask Chaos to sit one time, but I'm not going to ask more than three times. Good boy. I'm going to ask him to sit. If he does, I'm going to click, I'm going to treat, and I'm going to move forward. Then I'm going to stop. Chaos, yeah, sit. Good job. I'm going to click, I'm going to treat, I'm going to move forward. Chaos, yeah, sit. Good job. I'm just going to continue this every couple of steps. Sit. Good job. So as I'm doing this, I'm teaching him to pay attention and listen. If he had not sat, I would have moved backwards. And then just one step or maybe a couple of steps, depending on how, just, um, how excited he was. This is a really great game because it works your leash skills. It teaches your dog to sit if they get excited. Um, and you can work towards things that they really, really like. So there's a toy right here. And what I'm going to do... I'm going to try to put it in view. Hey, so I'm going to take this toy. I'm going to talk. Uh, uh, I know. He's it. So he really, really loves this toy, especially because I threw it. I'm going to use the toy as the reward in the end. Still going to click and treat him, but later on in life, I don't have to. Sit the boy. So I'm going to click and treat because he's not trying to go after that toy. I'm going to move forward a little bit. Sit. Good dog. Move forward a little bit. Good boy. And then I'm going to get it. Good boy, get it. You can get it. So the reward is if you get the toy after. So this is one way you can play this game is toss a toy for your dog to work towards, have a person that they're walking towards. Um, you can put their food bowl or put a bowl down with some treats in it, and they work towards that. But you're just working towards something they want, and they have to listen and pay attention. And then maybe not every step, but every couple of steps, every three steps. So that way they're focusing on you, and they're not pulling and dragging you towards whatever else it is. You don't always have to do sits, too. You can also use other behaviors, but I like sit because then they're not jumping, and there's a little bit more control element to it. 